It's true, not everyone can own a large EJ Gold canvas. Those that are fortunate enough to be able to accommodate a large piece, they, they are truly fortunate indeed. Um, because EJ's uh, jazz art, the large pieces you may know are seven feet by 11 feet. Uh, uh, some of them are six by 10 feet and the smaller big ones are six by three feet. So another point I wanted to make about his smaller jazz art pieces, um, they can be made into a print. And uh, that's for a buyer on a budget so that they can have something that they love. A woman that lives outside of Beverly Hills in, in Los Angeles it was a jazz aficionado. She attended the IAJE conferences um, in New York every year when they gave a conference there. And um, at one of the New York, actually the, uh, uh, when EJ was in New, uh, on stage in New York with the IAJE, the International Association of Jazz Education, Betty Hoover was in the audience. She saw EJ's work and she was, delighted to see it excited delighted and she bought uh three of the pieces uh one of them was uh, the his charlie parky priest some of us have seen that um and it was it she knew that it would be perfect for the concerts that she gave at home and her uh, the concerts were called jazz at the a-frame uh her her home her house where she lived was an a-frame a design and she gave these in very, very fine jazz concerts and EJ's jazz art was always on view. Uh, the three pieces that she bought in New York at the IAJE. So that's what happened with uh, some six by three pieces, which are larger pieces also that can be done.